टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस परमोटेशन एंड कम्बिनेशन ऑन माय चैनल चैनल मैथमेटिकल क्लिनिक ऑफ सुभाष झा द चैप्टर परमोटेशन एंड कम्बिनेशन बिगिंस विद टू इंपोर्टेंट प्रिंसिपल्स दो आर फर्स्ट एडिशन थ्योरम एंड सेकंड वन मल्टीप्लिकेशन थ्योरम मल्टीप्लिकेशन थ्योरम ऑफ बेसिक प्रिंसिपल ऑफ काउंटिंग दिस आर थ्योरम जन बेसिक प्रिंसिपल ऑफ काउंटिंग वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन बाय वन बाय टेकिंग एग्जांपल्स First of all, I am taking an example. Concentrate here. Suppose there is a tree, and there is a bird on that tree. Suppose this one is the bird, and here is a hunter. Here the mission is to kill the bird. Suppose this hunter has two types of weapons. Suppose. Three guns: gun A, gun B, and gun C, and two arrows: arrow P and arrow Q. Three guns and two arrows. Once again, I am going to tell you the example from the beginning. Suppose there is a tree. Now, on the tree there is a bird, and here mission is to kill the bird. There is a hunter. Whose mission is to kill the birds. To kill the birds, he has two types of weapon: guns. guns and arrows three guns and two arrows now the question is by how many ways can this hunter kill the birds bird of course you can say that this hunter can kill the bird by gun a by gun b by gun c by arrow p by arrow q by any of them so this work can be done by 1 2 3 4 and 5 ways this mission can be completed by this work can be done by five ways five way means 3 plus 2 3 plus 2 equal to five ways so to get the answer here we have added the options 3 plus 2 equal to 5 this work can be done by five ways i am going to take a similar example suppose this one is cta this one is ctb and this one is ctc suppose this one is kathmandu this one is mugling and this one is janakpur cta ctb and ctc suppose there are three main roads from cta to ctb and two main roads from ctb to ctc suppose this road is road a this one is road b this one is road c this one is road p and this one is road q and here is a person whose target is to drive from city a to city c his target is the mission of this work is to reach from a to c by driving now tell me by how many ways can you finish the work once again i am going to tell you from the question from the beginning uh there are three cities city a city b and city c and there is a man whose target is to go from city a to city c and options are available three options to go from a to b by road a by road b by road c and two options from b to c by road p by road q by how many ways the question is by how many ways can this person drive from a to c here answer is you can you can go from a to b by road a and from b to c by road p and can complete your mission you can go from a to b by road b sorry same road a and b to c by road q again you completed the you know mission by the similar manner you can go from a to b by road b and from b to c by road road p by road b from a to b 
and by road Q from B to C. Similarly, by road C from A to B and by road P from B to C. By road C from A to B and again by road Q from B to C. So we, you can complete the options by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 ways. Here the mission can be completed by the work can be done, done by 6 ways. 6 means 3 into 2. 3 into 2 equal to 6 ways. Now the matter is there was a similar question <coughs> in the first examination. Sorry, the first example. You added the options to get the answer. You have simply added the option to get the answer. And second one, you have multiplied the options to get the answer. Why? Why in the first example, you added the answer options to get the answer. And in the second one, you have multiplied the options to get the answer. There is something that we have to understand. Yes, that's the major thing, things to understand. Okay? In one example, we have added the options to get the answer. In another one, we have multiplied the options to get the answer. Now, concentrate here. Here, the options have been added to get the answer. Because the work has been finished in single level. Single level. Level is to be known. How many levels problem is this? You can see from where the work start. Work start from here. The hunter will strike the bird from this point one. And where the work will complete? Work will be completed here. The bird will be killed here. There is no disturbance from this point to this point one. This hunter will strike from here and bird will be killed here. No disturbance, no any disturbance between the point of strike and point of killing. So this is the problem of single level. No disturbance is there from the point of start and point of completion. If our work completes in single level like this, we add the options to get the answer. Here you can see that your target is to go from here to here. This one is the point of start. This city is the point of start. And this, is, this city one is the point of completion. There is the disturbance one. CTB is the disturbance one. To go from A to C, you will have to first to come at CTB. So first level is to come from A to B. And then next level is to go from B to C. Only then you will complete the work. So there is the disturbance one. If there is the disturbance, any disturbance between point of start and point of completion, then that is the multiple level problem. There was no disturbance from point of start and point of completion. Single level problem. We have added the options to get the answer. And here there is the disturbance like CTV here. So this one is the multiple level problem. If multiple level problem, then you multiply the options to get the answer. So we came to the conclusion. These are the example we are going to generalize now. If a mission completes in single level, if a mission completes in single level, only one level, only one level, and you, you have different independent options to do it, then the mission can be completed by the number of ways equal to some of the options. This principle is called addition theorem of basic principle of counting. But if a mission completes in more than one level, multiple level, multiple level means more than one level like this. And again you have different independent options to do it. Then it can be completed by the number of ways equal to product of the options. This law is called, this principle is called multiplication theorem of basic principle of counting. Now, I think you are quite sure about the matter. Only one thing you have to consider, focus, is whether the problem is of single level problem or multiple level problem. If there is only one level or more than one level. If only one level, then you add the options to get the answer. If multiple level, more than one level, two level, three level, four level like this, then you multiply the options to get the answer. We are going to use these two theories on various mathematical numericals.
the first example is first question is how many three digit numbers can be made using digits one two three four and five if in number one the repetition of digits is allowed the repetition of digits be allowed and in second number repetition of digits is not allowed here the question is you have to make a three digit number by using digits 1 2 3 4 and 5 three digit number means for example 123 is a three digit number even 122 is three digit number the question has told you to make three digit, even 562 is three digit number but this number cannot be included in our answer because question has told you just to include 1 2 3 4 and 5 here you have included 6 as well so this is not the required number you have to make this type of number how many such numbers can be made and even you know you can see that here the different you know digits are different 